Hello everyone, Manithrow here, and welcome to ARK. Now, I've been wanting to bring this to you guys for a little while. Uh, however, I usually have some issues recording it, and there for the longest time I had issues with my sound. But, it seems like things are starting to get squared away, because at least uh, OBS didn't freeze everything. But now, I am in a tribe with one of my friends, and some of his friends, uh, I'm getting to know them, basically. Uh, but so far, they gave me this as a present to help protect me the long time I died. Uh, but here is my main flyer. I got, a uh, Lamentia, I believe they're called. Oh, Lamentria. Uh, mostly because, uh, I heard they're actually, like, really good. For certain things now each 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 mount has their own specialty <laughs> uh that one can kind of slow down things that's why i wanted to get it and yes my base is a little weird uh, i have my miner i'll take him with me and do a mining time to time but now to show our base as a whole uh, i've been experimenting with breeding that's why i have those two here uh, but I don't have the time to really breed and keep them alive. Uh, here is my... F Settle down there, buddy. I believe this was my first mount. And it's because I was determined for him to be my first mount. And here's another one of mine. Uh, I just wanted to see what he would be good at gathering. Uh, everybody else, they have their... Own little bases, which is nothing wrong with that. Here's my buddy's one base. Now, we don't have any wyverns ourselves, so we haven't killed a wyvern yet. Uh, we are working on that, and I know uh, these arc episodes probably aren't going to be too um, common. Uh, they'll probably just be here and there, kind of like an update kind of thing of what's going on. Uh, but this is. Uh, the one person's base, she seems to really like the uh, steampunk type things. Uh, and another one of our tribe members' bases. There we go. Who's also into the steampunk kind of theme. Uh, but yeah, so there's their bases. I didn't actually mean to go on <laughs> I just wanted to make sure all the doors were closed. Uh, and there is our actual holding because we've been having a big problem with like manticores and wyverns attacking. Now I know some of our mounts are outside, some of our things are outside. This is uh, basically just one big giant. The I'll show you the inside here. The inside is where we keep the mass majority of all of our mouths. Um, what they do with them, because this is all the stuff that they captured, uh, that is up to them completely. So I, I don't really mess around with that, but they got a lot of stuff. And right by a water side where there's like these lobster things that are real pain. Here's basically our giant uh, commune area where anybody can do anything really in here. So there's just nothing really set against. It's just if you do take from there, you're supposed to contribute back. Which, to me, is quite fair. If you're going to take stuff, you should be contributing back. Uh, so I will say uh, my next target for one of my captures is I want to try and surprise them and I want to try to ca uh, capture a rock elemental. Uh, so that is my goal. I just want to show you guys the start of it to show you guys our bases. Um, one of the features I really like about mine is number one, my... One dino in here, he's actually my prize, right now my prize dino, because he can mine. But you'll see I have different layers here. This is one of my favorite aspects about my base. 
I have my flyers on the top floor. I should have built a three high, and I'm probably going to. This is way to make it easier, because sometimes I get stuck in there. But as you can see, yeah, it's a little dangerous, but it keeps my flying mounts safe. And to me, that is very important. But it doesn't look like there's any of those uh, drops around nearby, so I'm probably going to call it it for an episode. Uh, but this is my prize mount, and you'll see why. I mean, look at his speed. So, yeah, I have two things I want to get, I should actually say. Not just one thing. Uh, one is indeed the Rock Elemental. Uh, but before I even get him, I gotta be able to get a Mantis. And before I can get a Mantis, I gotta be able to kill a Death Worm. So, I will be... Oh, there's one way over there. Uh, he's not quite ready for that kind of a fire of a flight. Uh, but yeah, so... There's a lot of things you gotta do first in order to get what I'm going for. And I can make some explosives, I can make grenades, but they're not, kinda not direct damage because from what I heard, you have to be able to hit the rock golem in the face. Otherwise you might kill him. And if I'm trying to capture him, I don't want to kill him. So... That'll actually do it for this episode, though. I just wanted to show you guys a little bit of the base. And what's going on, what to expect. So, I hope you guys enjoy this. There's going to be a, more arc to come. Uh, how frequent is up to you guys, and just how well it wants to behave for me. Uh, of course, you know, if I want to do any group play, like right now, nobody else is on one. Uh, if I want to do any group play, of course I want to talk to them first and ask them to make sure it's okay. Uh, but before I even did that, I wanted to make sure the game was actually ready to show you guys. Uh, but thank you guys so much for watching, and until next time, later guys. It didn't stop. <laughs>